Hey, what's up? Robert here coming at you with another Photoshop tutorial and in this tutorial we're going to be taking a look at creating this effect. It's kind of a vintage Polaroid effect that'll make your photos look aged, maybe taken back in the 60s. So let's get started. The first thing I'm going to do is duplicate my background layer by dragging it down to the new layer icon. Then I'm going to go to image adjustments levels. I know you can't see it, but that's where we're going. And I'm going to bring this edge node back a little bit and bring this middle node up just to kind of increase the contrast. So here's our before and after. You can see it increased it just enough. Click OK. And now we're going to create a new adjustment layer. Coming down here, choose curves. We're going to go into the red channel and we're going to make a node here, bring this down, make a node here and bring it up. Let's go into the green channel, um, bring this down a little bit, and up. And then finally the blue channel, bring this down, and just like that. Now let's create a new layer. We're going to fill this layer with a gradient. So we're going to come over here to the gradient tool, which also can be found under the paint bucket tool. And we're going to choose this color here with the orange and the yellow. And make sure radial gradient is checked. And then find the center of your photo. Doesn't have to be exact. Hold down shift, click, and drag. Let go. And there you have your gradient. We're going to change the blending mode from normal to soft light. And bring the opacity down to around 50%. And then we're going to create another new layer. We're going to go to the brush tool. And I'm going to decrease the brush size here a little bit. I want the softness to be at zero. And change the foreground color to red. And just kind of paint in a little bit of red here. Alright. Now we're going to change the blending mode of this layer to screen. And at around 40%. Okay. And now we're going to add a hue and saturation layer. And we're going to bring the uh, saturation down a little bit to around 30, negative 30 or so. Then I'm going to create another new layer. I'm going to make sure my background color is set to white. And I'm going to hold down control backspace to fill that layer with white. Then I'm going to go to filter, noise, add noise. And I'm going to set the amount to around 35%, distribution uniform, and monochromatic is checked. Click OK. And I'm going to set the blending mode of this layer from normal to soft light at around 50 or so percent. And finally, I'm going to create one last layer. I'm going to go to the brush tool, maybe increase the size a little bit, change the foreground color to white. And just add a little white spot wherever you think it's necessary, if you want. And then set the blending mode to soft light. And around 90%. And there you have it. Your vintage Polaroid effect done in Photoshop. You can add this to your photos of, you know, maybe you at the beach. Um, any summertime pictures. Even if you're at a car wash. Look at this group of people back here. Look at that. Alright, well, you can follow me on Twitter at Rob's Productions. Visit the site, which is now running faster. And you can ask questions by emailing me at robert at robertsproductions.net. So I hope this helped. Thank you for watching, and until next time, take care.